All right, so today we're going to be talking about uh, a lot of people's favorite topic, which is budget. Now, this is what I would consider to be the most budget uh, dual tube night vision goggle setup that you can uh, possibly put together that's of any considerable use or value in 2022. This is the non-powered bridge mount, or NPBM, which is made by TNVC. It is a Delrin and aluminum constructed, very lightweight optics bridge that brings together two PVS-14s. These are both uh, Elbit Thin Film Gen 3 PVS-14s, both made by Steel Industries, which is a very reputable night vision builder. Um, had no problems with them at all. Great customer service, fast shipping. Uh, and these are just two independent units that are uh, brought together here and kept uh, quite straight by these brackets that uh, collar each PVS-14, keeping them straight. It is a dovetail interface, so it will interface with a, a standard Wilcox G24 or similar. I currently have them set up with these two shock cord straps here uh, so that they can be held tightly to my Team Wendy non-ballistic bump helmet. Uh, all in all, this setup should cost you, if you're paying about twenty-five to 2800 per tube, something in the realm of about $6,000. These bridges do come up used sometimes on sites like TaxSwap, but it's pretty uncommon as it's a fairly new product, and they can be pretty expensive. I think these run just over something like three dollars to $400 and are currently uh, available. I have Butler Creek snap caps here at the front. These are just scope caps that I have shimmed on so that these actually stay on pretty good. When you go to use the night vision, instead of removing a cap and having to stow it in a pocket or elsewhere, you can just hit the flip cap and the caps are kept out of the way by spring tension. You just wanna make sure that they're oriented in such a way where they won't get in the way when they're deployed. In general, this has been a very good, very reliable and robust setup for night vision. It's not the lightest weight. These uh, are about as heavy as a pair of GPN VGs. And with one battery on each side, it's not going to be as lightweight or counterbalanced as a PVS-31, uh, an ANVIS-style goggle, uh, or any of the Acton Black DTNVS type systems. That being said, this is significantly cheaper for current generation technology and more than usable at night in my experience. If you have any questions about this or anything else that I've discussed so far, uh, please do let me know down in the comment section below. Uh, this, again, has been a, a very solid uh, budget option, and budget obviously is a subjective term, but if you're looking to get into binoculars and you want something that is versatile, you can break either of these out easily, run a single tube, uh, or uh, you know, really give yourself uh, some more options in terms of beginner night vision. This is a good way of doing things. Thank you very much for watching our presentation, and have a great day.